Girl, how San Fierro? It's fucked up. I can honestly say I wish you was here. Great. Now you got the present for that friend of mine, right? You know, the one trying to get me and old Officer Pulaski into trouble? Yeah. Why don't you put that up in his car and give Wee Tip a call? Hey, motherfucker, the code of the streets is that I don't snitch. I don't give a fuck if it kills you, me, my brother. Street cats don't call no cops. Carl, he's a DA. Oh, uh, yeah? Well, where I go find him? He's at the Van Kauf Hotel in the financial. Oh, for sure. should help keep my belly full. Hello? This wee tip? I seen something highly suspicious you should come check out. Do you know who you're fucking with here? I'll have your badge, you moron! Shut up! You find anything back there? Found anything? He's got half of Mexico in here. Must be two tons of Mary here. What? But, but I've never seen. How could it be? Hell of a defense you got there, buddy! Hey, homies! What up, Carl? What the fuck is going on? Do I look like a hooker to you? What? Those Assholes keep saying shit to me. Who said this to you? The construction workers up that hill. I'ma fuck them up. Nah, hold up. I got this. I need to go teach him a little respect, huh? That's right. Yeah. I've been thinking about getting me some new land anyway. What's all that damn clatter? Holy crap, I didn't see nothing. You try to kill someone? Yeah, what? Yo, man! It's Jethro, dude! Hey, Jethro, what up? Well, I was talking to Caesar, and, uh... Don't get me wrong, dude. I mean, you are one out there dude when it comes to driving, man. But Caesar, he told us how many cars you get through, dude. And me and Dwayne were like, whoa! What is your point, Jethro? No, no point, man, no point. Just that there's an advanced driving school, like... Just up the road from the garage, man. Like in Doherty. Driving school? Man, exactly what you trying to say, man. Nothing, man, nothing. It was Dwayne's idea. I think you're, you know, cool and shit. I, I better go, CJ. I'll see you later. Welcome to the advanced driving school. To pass, you must score bronze or higher in all 12 tests.
To view a demonstration of each test, please use the TV over there. Passing a test will unlock the next test in the training program. You can come back and check your scores or take new tests at any time. Yo, dude, the garage is coming along nicely, man. But I rang about something else. There's an unofficial street racing club in San Fierro. Unofficial as in illegal, right? I don't know what you're talking about, dude. Anywho, they meet up around the driving school someplace. Thought you might, you know, like to know. Thanks, Jethro. I'ma think about it, and I'll holler at you. Later, man. Yeah, what? Sorry, Carl, are you busy? Zero? Nah, man, good to hear from you. What's up? Disaster. My landlord is selling the shop. I'll have nowhere to live and no safe haven from Berkeley. Ah, oh, I'm looking to invest in some property at the moment. Maybe I'll swing by. I bring a change of clothes to the prison. Hello? Carl, it's Zero. Oh, hi, Z. You wasn't around when I signed the deeds. Yes, I know. I was on a dangerous reconnaissance mission, deep into me? enemy territory. Uh, yeah, right, sure, whatever you say. I should come through and have a look at the business, you know? Oh, of course, of course. I'll have to tidy up a bit. This place is such a mess. Don't worry about it. I'll drop in soon. Hey, what up, Z? Nothing is up, Carl, apart from my blood pressure and the imminent collapse of my hopes and dreams. Why? As usual, the forces of darkness have triumphed over good. Life is nothing but misery, briefly interspersed with agony. Homie, what you own? Whatever it is, you need to reduce the dosage. Excuse me, but I never take drugs. We all know drugs are for losers and or sex maniacs. And right now, sex is the last thing on my mind. Thank God for that. Berkeley is back. Oh, Berkeley. Yes. Who the fuck is Berkeley? Oh, just a man I once beat in fair competition. A man literally obsessed with revenge. Oh, you put hands on him? No, please. <laughs> I never initiate violence. Oh, I know. You knocked this bitch. Uh, no. I won the prize in the science fair. <laughs> First prize, that is. And now you want to pop you? <laughs> no. And they say gangbangers is petty as small-minded. Hey, what's that bleeping sound? That's him. We shall fight to the end. If he takes them out, I'll never be able to launch a counterattack. No problem, man, but they're only toys. They're not toys. They're just smaller. CJ, bogey's at 12 o'clock. Well done, Carl. Now leave. I must prepare for the battles ahead. Never have so few owed so many. Too little three... No, that's not it. What is it? We will fight him on the beaches. Well, rooftops. Hey, Z, where you at? Go away, Carl. I'm, I'm very, very busy back here. Top, top secret stuff, not for your eyes. Too sensitive. Come on, homie, where are you? I said go away, Carl. I don't need any friends today. Thank you. <laughs> Man, them some pretty strong draws. Yes, my hero. Carl, he came back and humiliated me. I shall probably turn to prostitution now, where I will be found dead and broken. I am a 28-year-old man whose landlord just helped him down from a hook from which I had been hanging from my underwear, contemplating my inadequacy for nearly two hours. Ow, my crack. Look, you got to get even, homie. What kind of weapons you got? Uh, I've got a prototype of a miniature plane. Huh, well, with that plane, we gonna go humiliate Burke. Mm. 
Okay, cool. Man, this is ridiculous. That went right up my crack. Berkeley has his sycophantic lackeys do all his deliveries. Well, we shall hit him where it hurts the most. Bring his mail-order model business to its knees. Launch the Red Baron. No argument not from me or anyone else who has half a brain. I love the jungle. Carl, you were all a duelist like me could want in a second. Sir, I salute you. CJ! You got it? Hey, my cousin just called me. He gave me a tip about a baller's car going to San Fierro to score yay. Shit! We gotta find out who's supplying those cats. Read your mind, Holmes. I picked them up at the Mulholland intersection, and I'm trailing them now. Okay, I'm coming to meet you. Better make it fast, Holmes. These boys are hanging around. take himself real serious. That's T-Bone Mendez. What now? Is that it? Hey, who's the gringo? I don't like the look of that guy. This more than a few thugs pushing product. It's a serious organization. How many of these clowns are there? Ah, oh, I know a pimp when I see one. They being clever about this. It ain't no exchange of nothing incriminating. That was some heavy shit. We better split up and get out of here. I'll meet you back at the garage, eh? Coolio, we got what we came for anyway. Hey, Caesar, what up? I got the lowdown on Smokes Yay, where it is every Monday and Friday the cash leaves Los Santos for San Fierro. Then every Wednesday and Saturday, a courier takes the Yay back to Big Smoke. Okay, I keep an eye out for him. See if I can't spoil they little party. All right, man. <laughs> it's That's crazy, man. <laughs> what are you looking at exactly? Hey, cabrón. Hey, man, you get them flicks developed? What's up, woozy? Hey, Carl. I was just explaining to your brother-in-law that we were friends. Oh, yeah? Well, look, Woozy, I need to get some info from you, man. And what exactly do you boys want to know? Who are these putas, Holmes? Why don't you go take a look? These guys? Yeah. They're the loco syndicate. They're pretty big time, I think. Don't have any dealings with them. We don't touch blow. Now, this guy runs things. I don't know his name. This guy is T-Bone Mendez. He's the muscle. And who's that guy? That's Jizzy B. He's the biggest pimp in town. He helps set up the deals. You know, uh, concierge of sorts. Hey, did he my way in? How I get to him? Oh, Jizzy? Jizzy runs the Pleasure Domes Club in that old fortress under the Gamp Bridge. Hey, good looking out, Woozy. No problem. Don't be a stranger. All right. See, baby, I got everything. Mink sheets, mink coats, mink curtains in the window. When I walk down the stairs, I'm walking down on mink car. Now, who's this trick? I don't need no more friends, baby. All they try to do is peel me from my hole. Nah, nah, it ain't about them. It's all about you, player. 
I heard you was the man with the hookup, and you was the man I needed to see. I'm offering my services. Say what? Yes, sir. See, I'm new in town. Anything you want, I can do. For a guy like me to work with, to work for, a guy like Jizzy B? Well, well now that you mention it, I do have a slight problem. Something a little dumb muscle like yourself might be able to fix. Because you see me, <laughs> I'm intellectual. <clears throat> Bitches, y'all walk on down to the bar and fix a pimp a drink. Mm, mm, mm. See, I only got two eyes, and in these streets, you got to have more than that. You got to be like a flying shit, you know? A hundred eyes everywhere. Now some lunatic been fucking with my bitches. Motherfucker killed two last week. I want you to go find out. No problem. You my player partner now, Jizzy. Wait up! Mr. C to the J! See that pretty young thing in my car? Drop her off at the hotel downtown. Use my car phone and give me a ring a ding when you're done. And watch the rims, player. Treat that baby like the Pope Mobile. Hey, Jizzy, it's Carl. I just dropped off your girl. Church, got a little errand for you to run before you deal with that problem I was just talking about. Some young buck thinks he's a player been trying to peel my holes over in Hashbury. Now, one of my girls over there just eyeballed the punk. I want you to get your ass over there and ice that pretender. Hey. It's CJ. Just to let you know, you don't have to worry about no competition in Hashbury. Worry? Did I say I was worried? No, I did not. Now to the real deal. Some of my girls in the Foster Valley been getting knuckled over. I want you to get your ass up there and nose around. Find out what's going on. Mr. Jizzy, a CJ. Use a bad luck charm, Flunky. That girl you dropped off downtown wants out of the game. Her sugar daddy wants to take her off the streets. Nobody turns my hoe. You get your ass back to the hotel, and you make an example out of all of them. The Lord sent me to save your threadbare soul, harlot. Get in the car and remove your filthy vestments so I may better gaze upon thy corruption. Driver! Get us out of here before the devil's right hand snatches this poor girl from salvation. Right away, your evangelical holiness. I'm gonna spend this on a good me. Everything's been taken care of, Mr. Jizzy. Oh, CJ, you the player's right hand, baby. Oh, and by the way, that car's just come up over on the APB. Dump it, keep it, whatever. Just keep it away from me, my hoes, and my club. Oh, for sure, you got that, man. Hey, what's up? Hey, Carl, it's Woozy. Hey, if you got some time, I'd like for you to come over so we can talk about something. Yeah, for sure. Where you at? I own a little betting shop in Chinatown. Just come around and uh, introduce yourself. My people will be expecting a visit. It's a plan, man. Later. All right, come, come on, on you can do it. You come can on, do it. Kick ass, man. We're close, Puckeye. Easy, man. I'm here to see Woozy. Oh, uh, upstairs. Stupid ass motherfucker. I'm Johnson. I'm here to see Woozy. I work with him. Yes, right this way. Uh, you know of the boss's curse? Curse? Nah. He's blind. Blind? But we was just racing cars last week. Yes, I know. He's blessed with unbelievable good fortune. And the triad that would do anything for him? We call him our lucky mole. I, I keep that mom. Good. Woozy.
Hello, Carl. Hey, what's happening, Woozy? You know, how you doing? Straight to the facts. I can't use your help unless I'm open with you about who I am and what I do. Let me reintroduce myself. I am the boss of the Mountain Plowboys. Nice to meet you. Likewise. Why don't you sit down? As Dai Dai Lo of the Triad, it is my responsibility to see that disputes are settled without uh, damaging important business. Where I come in at? We shall see. I'm about to drop in on a local triad that failed to show face at the last Tong meeting. Come with me, and you'll see how we triad settle things without recourse to unnecessary violence. All right, I'll ride with you. This is a place. Come on, it's this way. Now, where's that loose cop? Hey, what the hell are you doing? Just uh, uh, checking the, uh, you know, just shut up, Carl. This way. In the street. Strange, this gate is usually locked. Stick close. Oh, man. Woozy. What's got you so spooked? Oh, oh, sorry. Didn't see you lying down there. He's dead. They all are. The blood feathers wiped out? Die, die low. Uh, forgive me. I was too scared to fight, so I hid. Enough. What happened here? Vietnamese surprised us. Cut us all down. Shit! Did they come again? Won't take more than a quarter. You drive. I'll send them back to the suit. Appreciation for what you did today. Now just listen to me, okay? Now it's very important that you listen to me. I ain't no weak tired, amigo. What you think? What, what, what you and Mike think? I'm just a pretty face to y'all? Is that y'all game? Now this here is the dumb muscle that I was talking about. Carl T-Bone and in reverse. Sup? Orale, sir. Don't mind him, uh, we go way back. Hey, Holmes, don't be such a beachy liability. Liability? Liability for what? Now there's three of us and I'm getting 20%. What type of math is that? That's fool's math, player. You and me. I sell my soul to you guys. And that's what it's gonna come down to, huh? Screwing me out of my 13%? You knew the deal. You agreed. Besides, we could have said 5%. And what would you and, and what, what, what? Cat got your tongue? You as bad at talking as you is at mathematics? Hey, you wanna make this shit personal, Wesse? Hello? Yeah. What? Man. Damn. Hey, man, I gotta bounce. Oh, no, you don't. I invented that trick, baby. Carl, <laughs> come with me. We gonna have to bust us a couple of melons up in here. What do you mean the shit bitch has been ambushed? We can't just go out there, T-Bone. It could be a DEA trap. Hey, Woozy, my man. What's going down? Hey, CJ. Let me introduce you to Shuk Fu, Ram Fa Lee. He heads the Red Gecko Tongue on the West Coast. How you doing? Yeah. Mm. Ah Ah Kung has sent word from Kowloon. A Vietnamese crime family, the Da Nang Boys, are preparing to move to the United States. This may explain the cowardly attack on the Blood Feather Triad. Mm. There may be some trouble ahead. Mm. The Shifu would like a package retrieved. A courier has left it in a drop at the airport. It is most important to the matter at hand. Oh, I can do that. Hmm? Huh. He is Triad? A mountain boy? No, 
a personal friend of mine. And less likely to draw the attention of the Danang boys. Okay. <laughs> Thanks for your support. Is that you again? T-Bone, pump your brakes, baby. Take a chill pill. And just lay back and let the red mist fall, brother. Hey, Holmes, open your eyes, dog. Can't you see we're getting messed with here, Holmes? Hey, partner. T-Bone, look. It's Carl. Now, he's a real hero out there. Sad. See? We still good. What, are you vato stupid? Someone's on to us. We need to go back and rethink. I think they was just trying their luck. Mike, Mike, I've been trying to contact you. What? Oh, man, who are you? Okay, just keep talking. Hey, Holmes, Mike's in trouble. Let's bounce. What trouble? Who was Mike? Man, they taking the yay shipment and the van, and Mike's still in the back. Well, what we gonna do? How the fuck we gonna know where he's he is? He's got his phone. He's gonna talk to us till his battery runs out. Come on, we gotta bounce. All right, let's jet. Hey, man, come on, hurry up. Apurate, apurate. It's about time, T-Bone. Who the fuck is this? Hey, that's one of Jizzy's clowns. Relax, Wero. You hear that? We gotta torch this van with the coke in it. Hey, Charlie, Wero, we ain't torching nada. This is a setback, but doing 20 to life is a little more than that. Comprende, amigo? Hey, he right, man. Let's do it and get the hell out of hey, here. Hey, who the fuck asked you, payaso? This ain't a committee. Exactly. I call the shots here. Now shut up and let's go. Johnson, you did good today. Man, now shake the spot. We got shit to talk about. Partner! Jizzy, what's going on? Well, my business associates, they need a little assistance. And I thought of you, friend. Meet T-Bone at the gas station next to the docks in the Easter Basin. He's waiting for you in a four-door sedan. Excuse me, partner. I got a call coming in. A river dirty. Yeah, whatever you say. Bye. Man, what the hell are everybody anyway? Who or what? Uh, what the hell? You think you can mess with uh, me? I, I will blow your head off and rape and kill your family, you snake! Uh, you think you can fucking bullshit uh, me and fuck me over? Uh, I know your uh, fucking uh, game, Essie. I don't know what you're talking about, man. Ah, my throat! Who you working for? Nobody! Turn around and look at me. I'm just trying to make some money. Keep my mouth shut, I swear, man. <laughs> I almost had you, man. I almost fucking had you. <coughs> Watcha? You gotta be careful in this business, man. You know that. Are you boys done playing around? Yeah, we're straight, Bottle. Oh, good. That's great. Now, we gotta go meet this shipment. We're late as it is. Let's go. You heard what Hefe said. Get out and grab a bike. The shipment has to get to the factory. You make sure it does, we make it worth your while. We're watching you, kid. See more, Nessie. We're watching. But the cops gonna be all over the spot real soon. Get the van out of sight. I'm gonna get out of here. Hey, CJ. What's up? Hey, what's up, Jethro? Some cops are looking for you in the office, man. 
ten pin. All right, man, I got mm -hmm. it. Nice to see y'all kicking back. Oh. I wonder how your brother's sleeping, curled up next to his shower daddy while you live comfortably on the outside. What y'all want this time? Well, what we want is to get on with our jobs in peace without some damn bleeding heart liberal poking his nose into affairs he won't even understand. The press on the uh? What the hell would you know about it, boy? Whoa, easy there, Eddie. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Some young journalist out there is trying to get a name for himself. He doesn't know how the streets work, that he's supposed to report what he's supposed to report. Yeah, anyway, we need you to shut him up for us. And that stoolie, shut him up too. Yeah, that's some reporter who's digging up dirt on Pulaski. We don't know who's talking, but we know the reporter's meeting him today. Take care of him. Oh, this is a nice place, Carl. Damn, where I put it? Where the hell did I put it? Shit. Hey, Holmes, you okay? Yeah, Woozy left a message say I gotta go get Jizzy's phone after he made the call. Then I can ambush the meat and take down those baller pushers from Los Santos. Hey, homie, you want me to roll with you? Nah, nah, this is a one-man job. I gotta stay real low-key. I was thinking about welding some shit together and making me a silence. <laughs> You're fucking crazy, Holmes. You gotta get out of this ghetto mentality. So what you thinking? Let me show you. Check this out, Holmes. Here, take mine. Where'd you get that? Same place I bought my pants, Holmes. This is America. You ain't getting in. Give me some room. Give me some room, bitch! It's that time of the week again. Your provider is about to make that special call. If I think for a moment that one of you hoes is hustling me... You better make a bigger cut this week, Jizz. We running low, honey. Shut up, bitch. I'm handling bitch. Don't you even raise your voice at me, no, asshole. shut up, bitch! <gasps> you funky ass. What a dick. Hey, Jizzy, I need to holler at you. Well, talk then, friend. I mean, that's all we ever do. Kind word here, wise saying that shit. I'm a walking book of proverbs. No, nah, you fucked up. C come on, man. Hey, I get it wrong, you know? I'm imperfect, you know, like, uh, hey, not a, not a kind man, not a wise man, you know, not, not a smart man, but, but dear Lord, I tried. No, nah, you fucked up when you trusted me, player. Come on, baby. I Ass selling. Yay pushing. Piece of shit trash. Oh, Lord. What y'all waiting on, huh? Somebody cap this nigga, man. 